long will the war last? Will our own cities and homes be bombed? Which is our number one target? Germany or Japan? What of the supply problem? Can we overcome the submarine menace? Can air power bomb Germany into submission? Can we build planes that can bomb Japan direct from continental America? Are we making full use of American air power? Should we have a separate and independent air force? Can air power bring us victory in the shortest possible time with the greatest saving in human life? Victory through air power. The thrilling graphic visualization of the book frankly and boldly brought to the screen with no punches pulled. A Book of the Month Club special edition condensed in Reader's Digest, syndicated in hundreds of leading newspapers throughout the world. Millions have read and discussed this book. No one can afford henceforth to believe he is thinking about the war if he has not read carefully and opened his mind fully to what Major Seversky has to say. The war hasn't produced as powerful a picture as Walt Disney's victory through air power, nor a more frightening document. A breathless story developed with imaginative sweep and power. A blast of gusty prophetic criticism, the kind of criticism heard all too seldom in the country at war. This is a powerful motion picture which everyone interested in victory must see. One of the most stupendous things ever put on the screen. Only the medium of Walt Disney could bring to the screen this vivid and dramatic forecast of events to come. Only in a democracy could this frank and critical motion picture be brought to the audience of this theater. Every American man, woman, and child must see victory through air power.